disappeared over the last week or so. He's been showing up to classes, but I don't know. It's like the lights are on, but nobody's home. You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> yeah that figures. So I did some digging. Oh, yeah? Look at this. He's been tweeting gloomy shit like I'll never love again on his private account. It's that bad, huh? Wait a second. How do you know what's on his private account? In cyberspace, I see all. You have any idea what's going on? Huh? Uh, no, no, I have no idea at all. Except I do. I know way too much. Kuribayashi, I want to thank you for renting me out the other day. He must have really fallen for Ruka. Well, anyway, try to see what you can do for him, okay? Uh, yeah, of course. You want me to talk to Kuribayashi? Yeah, I was wondering if you could just apologize to him or something. Eh, <sighs> but he's so yesterday's news for me now, I really don't even want to talk to him. So mean! But he did pay the fee for your services, right? And what you did was kind of out of bounds for a rental... <laughs> I haven't gone back to being a rental one single time since we started dating. If you want me to quit completely, all you have to do is say so. Besides, I was trying to keep it secret. You were the one who started following me. Yeah, I guess you do have a point there. But you started it by showing up at our school. Honestly, I do feel bad about what happened to Kuribayashi. But in order to get close to you, I had to break it off with him. It was just business. If I met him outside of work and he fell for me, I'd be digging my own grave. I'm afraid either way, the damage is done now. Anyway, forget all that. <laughs> I found this great little pastry cafe. How does Saturday afternoon sound? <laughs>